In the 1930s and 40s, the gender ratio of multiple sclerosis, which is an inflammatory degenerative disease of the nervous system, was a one-to-one. -one. In other words, for every man, there was a woman diagnosed. You know what the ratio now is? It's three and a half women to every man. Now that immediately tells us, A, it can't be genetic. Because the genes don't change in a population over seven decades or even ten decades or longer. Number two, it can't be uh, diet, because that doesn't change for a population. It didn't change more for women than for men. Nor can it be the climate. There's something going on. And whatever it is, it can't just be biological.